<laughs> hey, everybody. Tonight, yeah, this Tanika, if it, all y'all don't know. So we are, um, she's, she got something. What, what we, what, she did something new, y'all. So she want to share <laughs> that with y'all. I'm pretty sure y'all done seen her because we've been, we've been going there. And I'm guessing she's going to be like a, a, a month. <laughs> Do you hear that? No, it's Tanika. Tanika. Hello? What the world? Tanika. What happened? It's like something is... I don't know what happened. Hello? Hmm. Tanika, you hear me? Do y'all hear me in the chat? Tanika, you hear me? No. Do y'all hear me in the chat? It mm -hmm. sounds like some water running. Tanika, go out and come back in if you can hear me. Can you hear me? I can hear you, but it's like I just heard like water running. Let me see. Let me put it in the chat. Can you hear me? Um, yeah, I can hear you. Hold on. Do you want me to go out and come back in? Yes. I don't know, but it's like some water damn yeah. running. I don't know what that's about. Hold on a minute. Oh, you can hear me, April? That is how we roll. I don't know. It was just like we was talking and it just, something came on. It was like some water running and somebody said something. Can anybody else hear me besides April? You can hear me. Hey, Tamika. I seen Crafty Lock in here. Where she went at? There she go. Hey! There go Crafty Lock. And hey, Tamika. Hey, April. Let me burn some sage, y'all. You know, on YouTube, it'd be all kind of weird people watching you. And there's some good people watching too. This is, I think, yeah, Tanika son is to me. This um Pablo Santos Mountain Sage. I can hear Tanika now. I see her. Oh, you can't hear Tanika. Yeah, I can't hear Tanika either.
Mm-hmm. Did she go out? Tell her, let me tell her to go out and come back in. Okay. Can you hear me now? Yeah, I can hear you now. It was like some water was running. Okay. Can you hear me now? Yeah, I can hear you. Okay. It was like some water. I hear like a, a feedback. Do you got something else going? Yeah. Okay. You got do you got like something else, like something else on the volume up? Because I hear a feedback. <laughs> Tanika. Okay, hold on. It's lagging. Yeah. But I'm going to go out and come back in, okay? All right, Queen. I'm going to go out. Y'all thumbs up. How everybody doing? Y'all don't forget, Um, April 1st, I'm doing a live. I'm, well, I'm going to do a video every day. I'm going to do a video every day. And I'm going to upload some. I upload a video today. Kuti Jagalia. She going to come right back, y'all. And then I'm uploading a video to. Um, yeah, I'm uploading a video to um, the membership tonight when we get off. So y'all going to be, I, I got it right here. I got the earrings that I already did. I got so many DIYs to upload. How everybody been, y'all? I've been busy. So if I've been a little quiet, I've been busy. But I'm always here. And y'all, the ones know how to contact me if they need to contact me. That is how we roll. How everybody doing? What everybody creating? Tamika, you got to come back on and um, hey, Fire Water Unite. Hey, Fire Water Unite. Did you see the juicy picture? Hat? Yeah, I seen how you painted juicy. It came out cute. Well, um, what, um, what's her name? What's her name? Awena painted juicy real cute, too. Yeah, I seen how you painted juicy. It came out cute. Well, um, what, um, what's her name? What's her name? Oh, you you got something yeah. up. You got a volume up. Hold on, cause it's it's something playing back. How was that? Okay, now it sounds much better. Cause it was it was repeating what I was saying. Okay, sorry about that. No, you fine, Queen. This this technology. That's just the way it works. You know. Yeah, you doing that's, some weird, weird. It's like the old school way when we when I first came on YouTube, we used to do um, Google Hangout. I don't know if you remember that. That was so old school. It was the simplest thing, and then it's like they took that away, and now they. But y'all, um, let me show these real real quick. But yeah, I've been seeing everybody doing their juicy. I love how everybody creating her in their own little way. So juicy is available if anybody want to get juice juice. Um, then we got Bob. Let me move some of this out of the way. Then we got her. I painted her, but I gotta finish. I've been so busy, y'all. And then this will be the Bob stencil. And I haven't painted my cute um goddess lady yet. I've been busy, but tonight I'm going to paint this is Alien Goddess. Alien goddess. Because I got some alien superstar earrings that I created. And everybody said, you make a stencil. I was like, no, nah, I ain't making a stencil for her. But I make an alien goddess stencil for y'all. So that's what, I'm, what I got. So other than that, I'm going to let y'all, um, Tanika, do her thing. She got something she did. And she want to share it with y'all. <laughs> and y'all excuse her because she said her voice is a little raspy. But she's still here. So y'all go on. And you can go, you can go on on now. Okay. Hey, everybody. Uh, Hope y'all are doing good tonight. So I'm back again tonight. My voice is a little bit raspy. I think it's allergies, but other than that, I'm doing fine. Um, 
I've been doing a lot of painting, y'all, a whole lot of painting. So I wanted to come on and share with you all some of the things that I've been working on. Um, hope y'all are not getting tired of me coming on because I really enjoy. Um, no, you. It's a month. It, no, no. I gotta interrupt you. You can. You. You and Candace got y'all spots because <laughs> Candace will be on on the twenty eighth. Y'all got y'all spots. Y'all. Okay. Y'all locked in. The other ladies, y'all just let me know when y'all want to come on. All right. Well, that's good. That's good. Cool. Um, so I've been, well, I told you all last time that I came on, um, I want to try doing, wanted to try doing some canvas art and I've been doing canvas art all month. Um, the theme of tonight is, um, I did a new thing and I did this, uh, in part of, um, I read Tabitha Brown's book. I did a new thing. Um, Y'all, I recommend that everybody go out and read the book or get the book. I actually got it on Audible, so um, I actually read it through Audible. I had Audible read it to me, and it was really good. It sounds like um, like almost like a 30-day diary that she does. Uh, mm. Each day is a different new thing that she does. So um, I'm Oh, I've seen her doing that on social media. I should have yeah. seen her doing that. It's really good. She really goes through a lot of things. And I think a lot of things that she did will resonate with um, us as, you know, crafters, creators, artists, you know, whatever. Um, I, and, and women, especially black women. Um, mm. I think that her book will resonate um, in a way that is very positive. So um, that's kind of how I came up with my theme for tonight. So tonight I'm going to be going through different things that I have done within this past month, month, which includes the, um, the canvas art. So, um, first thing I'm gonna go through, I'm gonna go through the other things first that I don't have to show. I'll just tell you about what the things were that I did. Um, I'm going to do a new thing on here tonight that I never did. And, uh, yeah, so that's kind of the theme for tonight. So um, the first thing that I did is this month is I got a passport. Um, mm. I got a passport. That was on my list of things, my wish list or my bucket list, whatever you want to call it. Um, a few years back, it was actually before COVID, um, and I never got to do it. This year, I got that done. So that is off of my list. Praise be. That's yes. Um, the next thing that I did is um, I supported, <laughs> and I do this all the time, but this time I, I did it and I'm going to share it with you. And if you're somebody that I have supported um, you through buying something in the past and I haven't shown it, I'm going to try to go back and pull those items and come back and show people the different things that I purchased from other um uh creators, crafters, um yeah, maker. Be um because I think it's so important. Um it's one thing for us to to look at what each other creates, but being able to support someone it, it takes it to another level. Yes. I think I that agree. it's so important that we, you know, not only Look at what other people are creating. But if we see something we like, support the person. Um, because yeah. we all know as artists how difficult it can be um, being a creator. So um, this young lady I supported this month. And I wanted to just show what I purchased from her. When I saw the item that I got from her, I had to get it because it's like my favorite um, African symbol. So I wanted to make sure that um, I got it and I received her item and I love it. I absolutely love it. So um, this I got from, is it Tamika? You call her Spirit? Mm. I purchased. She was the black business that I supported this month, the month of March. Oh, she in there. And I support got these from her and I absolutely love them. It's the Sankofa symbol that I purchased from her. So I got these and she Yo, also, them dope. aren't they dope? I was like, I gotta have those. 
Yeah. I'm a fly right there. That's beautiful. it. That's it, Nika. I mean, yes. Tamika. You did that thing, girl. Yes. <laughs> I love them. I can't wait to wear them. I'm going to take a picture um, once I wear them. But I did want to show them because they are beautiful. And they're more beautiful in person, for real. So I got those. And she also sent me a bar of soap, which I've already started using. But um, that is great as well. It was like a um, oatmeal bar soap, handmade soap. Mm. So I wanted to show you guys that. So this will be the next new thing that I've done, support a business and not only support the business, but show the item that I purchased from the, the business owner. So that right there. Okay. Let's, let me say this real quick, Queen. I ain't want to uh -huh. interrupt you. Oh, but, yeah. Um, Firewater Unite, yes, I have stencils available. I go over them again, but I also sell them on Knor Designs. I go I go before we leave. And, um, yes, you can join the membership. I'm finna put the link in the description box. I mean, in the chat. So, you'll see the link is $14.99. You'll get two DIYs a month. And you can also come on if you want to show what you created. You don't have to show just the... Um, the DIYs, you can show anything you create. Um, and that's you can come out on the eleventh of the eleventh and the twenty first. I know I missed the twenty first, y'all. I was just so busy. But I'll be going live again on the thirtieth. And once you join the membership, you can also just hit me up and say, I want to go live for an hour and just sh talk about what I want to talk, you know. So that's that's how it go. But I will go over the um stencils after Tanika finished presenting to us tonight. I just, I, I want you to keep answering. I wasn't um typing in too fast. All right. <laughs> and uh, thanks all who in the chat. Y'all a thumbs up the video. You can go queen. Okay. And those <laughs> ear earrings came from Spirit. The name of her business um, is Creations with Vibrations, LLC. And um, uh, is it Vibrational 19? Is it 1982 was her? Instagram, I think, yeah, yeah. Um, Tamika, put your um your Instagram in. I think it's vibrational eighty one. Her Instagram, Instagram. Yeah, them nice. I okay. like the earrings you got on, Queen. Thank you. I'm fly. Thanks. Okay, so yes, yeah. vib vibrational nineteen eighty two. All right, so yeah, I, I wanted to show those because those, these are, these ear, earrings are dope. I can't wait to wear them. Yes, <laughs> I can't wait to wear them. Don't, yeah, don't so, lie. Yeah. Okay, so the next thing that I'm going to do is um, every now and then I write little short poetry, um, but I've never read anything. So I'm going to read something that I wrote and um, yeah. So I'm gonna share something that I wrote. Okay, you gotta snap, snap, snap. Okay. Shake, shake, shake. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is called soft, soft spoken. I know this lady. She seems to be soft spoken. Maybe she's healing. You know, heartbroken. No, I'm not joking. When I see her, I give her kindness, a smile. A nod, kind of as a token. You know, words unspoken. No, I'm not joking. That lady is a queen. She's just soft-spoken. Mm. Okay, I did that. That's it. That's that, so cute. That's it. That, it's, it's short. So it's just something that I wrote real quick. I like that. Make me want to start like a, a unity poetry moment. I don't know if you know, I was a poet for 13 years. I, I've heard you say that. And I've mm -hmm. written things. I never really shared anything. That was just something I wrote real quick. So I said, let me just go ahead and share that. That'll be, That'll be fun to, to, to start a, like a little poet. Um, I like it. Um, Fire Water Unite says, I love it. Soft smoking. It was nice. It gave me little chills. Took me uh, back to my days of being a traveling poet. And I done been on the stage with some of the dopest poets. Um, matter of fact, Queen Sheba just won a Grammy. And I done shared the stage with her. I, we follow each other. I know her. She done got my earrings. 
So she just won a Grammy. So no matter what we do, no matter if it's art, poetry, you can go to the highest heights with with it. So always remember that. Wow. That's dope. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all get a chance. Look up Queen She, but she won a Grammy for spoken um spoken um word. Okay. Okay. All right. So um the next thing I wanted to um I saw something on your um Instagram. I brushed mm -hmm. my locks too. Yeah, a lot of people don't. Yeah, I brushed but my you locks know, too. It um that come from old school. That come from my ancestors. Did you know the old school women before they go to sleep, they brush their hair and they wrap it up and they you know and it it stimulates and it, yes. I just like doing it. It make me feel relaxed. Me too. Yeah, it does. Mm -hmm. I, I mean, I brush the the scalp area and I go down the you know, mm -hmm. hair and brush that too. So yeah, I saw that and I said I gotta let her know that I brush my locks too. <laughs> <laughs> Brush my locks lately. Thing. That's why they grow. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay, so um, the next. I thing, like this live. It's so dope. <laughs> oh, thank you. Okay, so the next thing, right, is the canvas art. Um, I've been doing a lot of painting this month, y'all. A whole lot of painting. So I hope y'all are patient with me. I actually have one, two, three, four paintings I want to show that I've done this month. That's dope. Since That's I said I painting. was going to start painting. Okay, so this first one is, um, you all saw the beginning of it, where I drew, I was doing some uh, line drawing. I was doing it on a regular piece of paper. And something told me, take this and put it on a piece of canvas and work around it and create something. So that's what I did. Um, one of the things I'm working on is being obedient. Because um, for a very long time, I would have thoughts about doing things and um, I wouldn't do them. I wouldn't. Mm. And in case you all don't know or haven't noticed or realized, I'm a little bit of a um, perfectionist. So mm. um, if something wasn't perfect, if I didn't feel it was perfect or I didn't think other people would think it was perfect, I wouldn't, I wouldn't fool with it. I wouldn't do it. Yeah. For a long time before I started painting, I had thoughts of painting and doing different things, but I would never do it. Like I would never come on alive. I would never paint. I would never do anything that would, that I didn't feel was perfect. Yeah. And um, I am getting over that. So I want to share that because I'm, I'm getting over that. And I realize that nothing is perfect and everything is perfect. If you Come know on. I know exactly what you mean. We, yeah. you perfectly you. Yeah. Perfectly you. So um, I, you know, do want to start sharing the things that I create. And um, hopefully I will be um, an encouragement to other people to get out of your comfort zone and if it's just fear that makes stops you from doing something that's the reason mm. you really need to do it yeah you're supposed F to fear. do it if F yeah. fear exactly yeah <laughs> that's one of the biggest diseases i say that in one of my poems that's one yeah. of the biggest diseases like what is that anything quote it says it's a thief of dreams or it, mm. it, yeah it's going to rob you of your true, authentic life. Um, yeah, fear. Just do it. True. So um, that's kind of my message for tonight as I'm doing these new things. Um, yeah, I want to share them in, in that light. So um, this painting that I did, um, my painting style is, is somewhat eclectic. Um, I heard you mention the word indigenous. Um, mm -hmm. I could see that. I could see that for you. I, I see that um, in your work. A bit psychedelic. It, it's it's mixed. So, mm -hmm. um, and you'll kind of see once I show it to you the different ones. You know what what it is that I mean, and yeah, we can um, go from there, kinda. 
Okay, so I'm going to flip the screen and I have the first art piece up in front of me. Um, and the way that I did this piece in, um, is I made it so that um, it, it flips. And I'll show you as I turn the screen what I mean. So I'm just going to turn this like this. Uh, I don't think it's going to let me do that. It should make you turn, let you turn it. Hold on a second. Okay. There you go. Let's see if it lets me do that. Okay, so can you see that? I don't think it's going to let me turn it that way. I could, I could. Can you see? Yeah, I could see it. I could see it. It's the playback on my other end going, but I could see it right over here. Okay, I see it now. Turn it. Yeah, I could see the it. The other way. You can Okay, I might Turn just it have the to... other way. You just had it. Uh, like this. I mean, you could keep it that way and explain it. We're just looking at it sideways. Mm. That's true, Crafty Locks. Crafty Locks say, I completely understand. We don't realize we are holding ourselves back when we are fearful. Yes. Y'all just got to do it. If it's a YouTube channel, if it's a... Uh, a art piece, some clothes, you know, just getting in front of the camera talking, just just do it, you know? Yeah, um, do it afraid. Do it yeah. afraid. Um, and they and they liked your um your um poem. Thank you. It's not I I didn't realize this screen is not gonna let me turn it so you can see it all the way. But we could see um, it this way. I could see it. You can. Yeah, I can see where you got it up. She got heart. I like the way you incorporate everything is love. Okay. Um, A's creation say, I love how Tanika is blossoming. You are a beautiful person and an artist. Thank you for sharing. Oh, that's so sweet. <laughs> April always say sweet stuff. <laughs> she is, oh, love bug. Uh -huh. <laughs> that's what I'm going to call her that. Yeah. Okay. But that was that was sweet that she said that. All right, so I can move. And one thing I can say, April, do support everybody. She like air. She like Miss Heidi. She will like she everybody's do. stuff. She um support and she comment. So April, I think April, you come on on the fourth for the sixth. I can't remember. I know you come on one day, and um, begin your birthday the fourth or the fifth. Of April, I just realized your name April and your birthday April. <laughs> that is how we roll. She coming on on the fifth. The fifth. Oh, yeah. okay. Okay. I can't wait, April. Yeah, I can't wait to see yeah, April. I remember April okay. used to be nervous to go live. Yeah, and she be going live. Yeah, I, I feel like alive. it gets better the more you do it. Yeah, the more you keep it gets going. Easier. Yeah, so that's kind of where I feel like I am um, with it right now. But okay, so this is the first piece that I did from the um, the line drawing, um, and I want you to keep an open mind when you look at it because the way I did it, I wanted it to be. I want. When people, certain pieces of my art, when you look at it, I want you to, you know, look at all of it because I feel mm. that it tells a story, your story, but you can see a lot of different things in the art that I create. Um, I see it. I see so, so much. I want to um, just kind of walk you through some of what I was doing when I created this piece. And I want to say that the only thing that I knew um, that I was drawing when I started was the the face part um, that uh, I showed you all originally from a mm -hmm. couple of videos ago or whatever. But the more that I started to paint, other things started to be revealed. And that's kind of like my painting style is that when I look at something, I start seeing other things and then I just incorporate them that way. One of the things I told you that I was going to incorporate was hearts. So I uh, mm -hmm. definitely had that theme on my mind when I, I started. 
Um, so when you look at this painting, um, I made the woman that you see, uh, I made her somewhat, um, just the word I want to say, um, mysterious is, is not the word that I want to say, but when you look at her, I want you to ask yourself, are you looking at her from the front or are you looking at her from the back? Mm. <laughs> it's interesting because it looked like she's both. Like a duality. Yes. So and she, um, I do see the indigenous. Yes. She can me a little chill. <laughs> Hopefully in a good way. Little, yeah. yeah, it's a good way. Okay. It's positive. So, I love it. I love the, the originality. Um, at an art show, somebody about her. Because yeah. I'm real, like when I do, like when I see art, I'm the type of person to go to something that no one else probably wouldn't go to. And I know it's a lot of people like me. Kelly says she see both too. Yeah. Um, um, A's creation say, I see heart. You sharing different kinds of love <laughs> uh -huh. so for me you know no. everybody see art a little different like if different. you put this piece right. even the artist got her way of his or her way of what they see but when you see art um like if you put this in an art show you'll have like so many different people will have a different interpretation of right. what, it, what it means to them that's the beauty, beautiful thing about art <laughs> So, you know, sometimes I look at her and I say she's looking at me, but then other times I look at her and I'm like, she's looking forward and her hands mm. are behind her back, mm. bracing that heart behind her back. I love the way you, even her face, her hair looked like a heart. Her hair looks like a heart from this direction. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm, the, what's her name again? You know, I haven't named her yet. Um, you haven't named her yet? I haven't. I've been playing around with her name because nothing has really res totally resonated with me. And I, I want to give her a real good name, a special name. Yeah. Well, for now, I'm going to name her Indigenous Heart Goddess. You know me, Al. <laughs> okay. All right. That. You know, I'll be naming stuff Indigenous Heart. Like, she cute. And it's look like she's it, it's interesting because it looked like she's in nature, but it also she's in nature, but it like she's sitting in front of water. Yes. And I like the way she's squatting because that remind me of like the African squat, like how we sit naturally without a chair. Right. I don't know if you ever seen it. Some people call it the Asian squat, the African squat. And it's crazy because my youngest son, he was when he was born, he would just naturally sit that way. And I looked at him because I study a lot of culture. And right. I'm like, he just came out sitting that way. And it was just so dope for me to see him do that. And, like, I didn't show him that. He just literally came out. Naturally. Naturally sitting that way. Wow. Yeah. Yeah. He's going to be 24 now. But I'm at, I don't know. I'm going to see. Do he still sit that way sometime when he squat down? He squat <laughs> just like that. And that's a good way that women, like, are picking up femininity. Women, when we when we have our babies, that's how we squat. We wasn't like up like that, right? That's Back in the day, have a lot of problems when they have babies in the hospital because it messed with our tailbone and stuff like that. We supposed to be squatting like that, exactly. Even when we use in the bathroom, we supposed to have like a little, you know, we supposed to pull our legs up a little. So, yeah, right. it's so it's so is uh, this piece is to me. It's spiritual, it's indigenous, it's love, it's self-love. It's mainly what you was talking about earlier, like no fear. You know, just, this me, take me as I am. Yeah. It's so much in that art piece. Um, also, I, I think that when I, uh, for me, also what resonates with me is her being a part of, uh, a part of, nature the world the earth. Mm -hmm. i can um, see that if you look you know she's well you'll see more when i turn it around if i flip it around you might be able to see more but i'm gonna just move the camera just a little bit so that you can see um what the sides look like so over here is what could be depicted as a, a tree 
Okay. Um, you know, down the bottom is, I guess, the roots, and it's that heart shape again. And then the same thing on this side. Okay. So, let's hold on a second. All right, so I'm going to flip it around, and then you can see the other side. Oh, that's dope. I like your trees. Okay. Okay, so flipped around. Uh, same, everything's the same. But I want you to look on this side. Mm. About your trees, or what was your trees? Mm. And then, of course, there's one on this side too. How long you been? How long you was on this piece? How, how many hours? You know how most artists they write like I yeah. spent this much. This one, it took me a, um, a few days. This was the first one that I did. It took me um, overall, I say a few days because it probably took me really about two days. But I go back and I, I look at things. And sometimes when I look at things, I see other things. And then I, you know, go back and, uh, you know, tweak or, or work on what it, what it is I see. Yeah. I say three days. Yeah, and I can see the hearts, the upside down hearts. That's so dope. And the bottom of the tree look like it's hearts. Somebody say they see a womb. Okay. Tamika, Tamika say she see a womb. Kelly say she see both. A say I see hearts. You're sharing different. Oh, she already read that one. Okay. So with this, this angle for me is... um. The tree, the tree leaves have turned into grass um, from this mm. angle. Okay. Um, I see a flower. Yeah. Um, yeah, I see a flower. I see a womb. Um, <laughs> what she was. Hey, Sonovia. <laughs> Hello, hey Sonovia. <laughs> um, that's so dope. Her, what she was sitting on has now become looks like it could be the sky. Mm hmm. And then that when it was lower, it looked like water to me. It, it looked like, like she was water. in front of water. So with this piece for me, you know, it just shows uh, our connection to the earth. Um, yeah. You know, the sky, the trees, the flowers, you know, the grass, the leaf, everything. We're all connected. Yeah. And that's me, like Avatar. Yeah. I did some earrings. I don't know if I still got them up, but I say we are nature. Growth. Yeah. Yes. That's beautiful. Um, uh, it shows her being centered. She's centered mm. in love. She's, you know. She's full of love. I can yeah. not tell you that now. And she's centered in, in love, especially self love. Yeah. That's dope. Yeah. Is that a flower? Yeah, it's a flower. I thought it was like a um dragonfly at first, but it's a yeah. flower. And then the little hearts. Those are like that, petals. Yeah, those like petals. That's so dope. Mm -hmm. Seems like you took a lot of um time and I like the way you did the trees and you made them look like grass I like the way you did them that's yeah. a powerful piece when you start your YouTube channel well you already got a YouTube channel you can um like just show it out big you know and explain way. it yeah yeah I could even yeah. see her on t-shirts and bags yeah 
Yeah, y'all please follow me on YouTube because I will start. I'm gonna start painting live. What's your YouTube channel? Um, it's uh, at Soul Creations by Tanika. Yeah. Okay, and I'm putting it in. The, um. Oh. I see YouTube letting us put at now. <coughs> All right, Put so that, that's that piece right there. Um, Let us know when you name. I know when you are, you will know the name that come to it. To, yeah. There's so many names that that she can be. All right, so that one. Okay, so the next one I have is um, it's one that I posted, and I'll go through her real quick, and then I have two more after that that I've worked on. Um, and none of the, I haven't named any of these yet. So if y'all think of names, you can put it in the um chat because I haven't named any of them yet. I've just been painting. Yeah. That's it. Just painting. So, okay. It's, I know it's relaxing. Just doing our earrings be relaxing. So just imagine doing that. I got some big canvas pieces. I got to finish. I, they, I got pieces that I ain't messed with. Probably. 10 years I need to, <laughs> I'm being honest, I got to go back in. And I'm kind of glad I waited because I got more skill, you know? Yeah, yeah. I'm to finish them up. And I know you you, all, you have always dope stuff anyway, so. Give thanks, I love, queen. I love seeing your stuff. Yeah, I got to um, usually put, well, some of my big pieces, I, would, I was doing a series on my Unity Art Piece channel, but I need to. Go clean that channel up and and um finish some of them art pieces. Like you inspired me to finish some of my um pieces. Okay, cool. I got a whole bunch of them. Ooh, I can't wait to see them. Yeah, I'm gonna um clean some of that stuff up and get them out. Start selling them. Okay, so this one right here, I worked on. I see a little little spot I need to touch up right here, but. Um, this is one I work on. <laughs> Artists don't always see something. We'll keep going. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is one that I worked on. Um, no name for her. Again, I incorporated, um, I started off with the heart thing. I started off with that automatically. When I see where I can put something like that, I immediately put that in there. Um, so that's how I created her hair. She has locks. Um, and she is just, you know, she's um, basting in peace and mm. just, you know, her eyes are closed. Mm. Just, you know, she's obviously a queen. Um, it's nice. And, and she's just, you know, feeling, she feels, she feels good. She feels good. I like good. your style. Yeah. I know it's gonna buy more, but I like it. It's unique. It's yeah. different. It's a it's a it's a place for it. So just keep going. Don't give up. Okay. And Thank you. Yeah. It's a I like it. Um I'm not sure what more I can say about her, but she's just um she divine. She's a, she's yeah, dope. She's a proud black woman. She, you know, she's just High energy. She's a goddess. She's peace. She's love. She's light. She's all those good things. Have you ever have you ever looked at a definition of sublime? Um, I, I kind of know what it means. Yeah, that's yes. what I see when I see her. Yes, sublime. Yes, that's what I look. For. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I have her. Um, and with her, I did a mixture of, oh, I didn't tell you. Okay, so the first piece, just to let you know, that was all done with um, the techniques that I use on my painting is I use watercolor, mm -hmm. I use acrylic, and I use, um, I put a lot of uh, energy into my paintings, just a process, a couple of processes that I do requires mm -hmm. energy with my hands, but I also do finger painting. So, for example, yeah. trees, 
The trees, yeah. I knew that they yeah, looked yeah. good. That was all finger painted. Um, on mm -hmm. this queen right here, um, I use watercolor, I use acrylic, and I use oil paint. Um, her face is oil painted. Her, her, her skin is smooth as silk. Um, she's flawless in her face. Um, but I do oil painting for her face. Um, I did finger painting for her hair. Mm. Um, and uh, so you use a couple of techniques. Yeah, I, I do. Yeah, I use different techniques. Um, I did a lot of brush stroke in her hair. Um, I use fabric, of course, as you can see the fabric in there. Um, I'm trying to think, is there anything else that I used? I think that's it. But yeah, so that's her. And um, yeah, I said oil painting, right? And the oil painting, I don't know if anybody's familiar with oil paint. Um, all of this stuff, I, I'm learning as I go. Like I yeah. started experimenting with, um, well, I've done watercolor before, or water paint. And of course I've done acrylic. The oil paint, this is the first time I've used oil paint. Oil paint is a process, it takes Time a minute to dry. dry. Yeah, it takes yeah. time to dry. So um it's, it's I like working with it though because it doesn't dry quick like acrylics would dry. So it allows yeah. you to go back and tweak things. Like I can go back the next day and you know tweak something if I need to because the oil paint yeah. isn't even dry yet. Mm -hmm. So um, I thought that was pretty interesting, and I actually liked that part of it for certain things. Um, on, on a you know with a painting. Um, so yeah, that's what I did with her, and I think that's pretty much it with her. Um, let's see, I got a couple more. And the last one that I'm going to show you, I'm not quite finished it yet, but I'm going to show it to you anyway. It's actually hanging on my wall back there. If you, Well, you can't mm. see it from that angle. I'm sorry. You can't see it from there. But I'll show it to you in just a minute. Okay. Okay. All right. So this one right here, I think right now, by far, she's my favorite. Um. And let me put her up here. Hey, girl. Hey, girl. <laughs> Cutie. That's dope. Here? I like her. I like the, I'm loving this heart thing. Yeah. I went through that. I went through that probably like a couple of years ago. Uh -huh. I think it was around like it had been around like 2013. I had a breakup with someone, and I um just started buying love stuff, just stuff that say love. It was like I was like on the self <laughs> love thing, so it was like every I got a dress that got love all on it. I got a shirt that say love. I got um <laughs> pants. Like I just bought everything that say love. So that's what it kind of remind me of. Okay, is that is that what that's makes dope. you do it? <laughs> Yeah, he that particular one was a something. I feel you, girl. <laughs> but it's but crazy because I wasn't in love with him. But w that particular person, I wasn't in love with him. Um, it was just me after that situation, and I might have to do a story time with that situation. That was from like two thousand and one to like two thousand thirteen. <laughs> but um, it wasn't. I wasn't in love with him. I liked him, but what it made me do start just loving myself more. So that's why I had went to like everything I wore had love, the word love on it. Yeah. I, I can mm -hmm. I can I can get that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, definitely. So this one right here, um, she is inspired by uh Crown Goddess. Oh, okay. 
Um, oh, I just I, ne- I didn't even look at that and see that till you just said. Yeah, she's okay. inspired by Crown Goddess, and I put my own spin on her. Like I said, I, I start with um, you know, I started with the let's say the outline of Crown Goddess. I drew her. Um, yeah. And then I started to add my touch to it. Yeah. So if y'all don't know who the Crown Goddess is, it's a stencil. Let me see if I got her over here real quick, Tanika. Okay. So I could show y'all. I don't, hopefully I got her over here. I got stuff everywhere. Where you at, Miss Girl? I had just did some earrings of her. Oh, um, yeah. I've showed it. I've been doing These, a couple of things with her. I love working with her. Yeah, she you could do a lot with her. So this is this pair right here is going to Brazil. Ugh. So this is her pair, and I want to show y'all my version if I could find it. Um, I thought I had mine's over this way. Let's see. Where you at, girl? <laughs> Calling the I know I got my version too. It's mainly the same, but it's a little different. The one that I showed y'all, what I was painting. Uh -huh. So this is hers, but I made up because you know, when I do the um, you can keep talking. I just um find her as you talking, but yeah, yeah. that's my version. That's yeah. the pair that's going out. So this it's crown beautiful. goddess, and she's a stencil. Yeah, this is so, what I drew from her. She's a stencil. Anybody that hasn't gotten her, she can do a whole lot with her. Lot. I have yeah, even done. I, I love I told the you way I had an idea. Using, yeah, you literally doing this with this with the stencils. What I um what I what I love when people do with the stencils, they take them and they do. You could do so much with them. You can take them and um intertwine them, like mix them together. Take a face off that, and you know. Right, and, but you you do you doing exactly what? It's so much you can do with the stencils, but I don't have one of the crown goddess stencils. They be selling so fast, I have to print some more out. But yeah. um, yeah. So that's crown goddess, y'all. I was looking for my yeah, so, Um, yeah, she was definitely the inspiration for this piece right here. Um, I knew that I wanted her to have hair, so um. You know, I saw the opportunity to make her hair big and, and in the shape of a heart. Um, I so love the way I, you did the, the hair. You did a finger paint technique with the hair, too? Uh, yes. I did a combination of finger paint, and then I just did uh, just free spirit painting. Mm -hmm. you know, just, you know, taking lines and just free spirit um, painting for her hair. It look good. Um, she uh, she has her my side beading around her neck. Mm -hmm. She has her gold yeah. buttons down the front. Um, the background is uh, greenery, and that's finger painted. Okay. And, um. So with this one, I originally started with her and the only thing that was on the canvas was the green background and uh, her beading and then all the way down. So if you looked at, at the painting from the center, so for, from the top to the bottom in the center, that was what was mm -hmm. on here. So basically none of the um, outside flowers were on the painting. Uh, it was pretty, it was just like a clean uh, background in the background. And I left it like that for a while. One of the techniques that I use when I do my paintings is I hang my stuff up. As mm -hmm. I paint it, I hang my stuff up so I can see. I like to look at it because as I look at it, I see different things. I see where something else might need to go or I see, you know, yeah. whatever. But I like to hang it like it's gonna be hanging on the wall, so I, I that's one of the things that I do. Um, 
So I hung her on the wall for some days. And the only thing that was on this uh, canvas was uh, this part right here and then down here. So I didn't have anything on the sides. It was just like a, a orange type background or peachy, whatever color that is, background. How big is she? She looks huge. Uh, She is. She's a, I think of like a 30 by 30 approximately. That's beautiful. And you, you painted all them this month? Yeah. When I, wow. when I start painting, I go on like a, I do this thing, like I get hyper-focused and I, I just paint. I just paint. Wow. I wake up in the middle of the night and I, I paint. I wake up in the morning. That's, that's it. That's and it. And I paint. I, I paint. Yep. That's it's all like I a, do. a weird thing, you know, I, and then it's I might relaxed. go for. It's addictive. It's addictive. And I might not do yeah. it. But then when I do do it, it's like, okay, it's like, a. I can't explain it. I I know exactly what you're talking about. I it 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 does something to me. It does painting does something to, to me, especially spiritually, but it also heals. Yeah. It heals my soul. Yeah. It makes me feel so happy, you know. And yeah. just to see what I can do with it, I know that I've been doing art for so long, but I know I haven't got to my highest potential of what's in me. Right. You know. And the more, yeah, you, I feel show, like the more you do it, the more stuff starts pouring. More things come out. Pouring and through surround you. yourself with artists. And surround yourself. Look on YouTube at different artists and learn different techniques. And you can incorporate it to what you already do. Never just say, I know how to do this and just do that. Always learn little different techniques and stuff. But right. so this what I had. This is Crown Goddess. This what I had showed y'all when I was painting. Painting. My version of how I did, I made like a shield with her, with a little flat back. Oh, yeah. So this is my pair. And then when the, the sister ordered, you know, I did them. You know, they similar. I did them a little different, but they similar. Those so are always, nice. So you still to get your own little unique, you know, even though I duplicate, you still get your own little unique. Because even like the beading. It's a little beading, different. Right. A little different. So it's still one of a kind. I just wanted yeah. to show that. When I yeah. Um, yeah, I love those. I think, like I said, I love working with this particular one. Yeah, um, she she is a, a lot of people like her. She's yeah. a, even if you look at if you look at how I did the um this right up in here is a little different. It's a little you know you see it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So every little every time I re make a pair, it's gonna be a little different. But yeah, yeah. she's dope. She's dope. Yeah. So, and I, I think my girl, I, I feel like she came out as maybe a, a young girl. Mm -hmm. um, I didn't necessarily plan for her to to be. She useful, looked young, but she's but young, she and I love it. She looked like she got wisdom. She looked yes. like she got wisdom too. Both. I love it. So, um, that's a lot of. So, how many hours you spent on her? You don't remember? Um, for her. Um, I'm going to say it might have took me, I don't know, a couple of few days. But again, you know, like I said, I hang her, I hang it up. So when I was I explaining for the couple of few days, I just had the the background as far as like the green in the background. And I had the center part. I didn't have any additional flowers on the outside. So and I hung her up and I, and I thought she was finished. But when I came back, well, mm -hmm. I really thought she was finished. Every day I would wake up, she was finished when I looked at her. I woke up one morning. I got out of the bed. I came into the area where I had her hanging. And I said, she's mm -hmm. not finished yet. I flipped her around. And then I started the next part. And that took me, you know, maybe a couple more days. Oh wow! So is she finished? Are you gonna add? You know how it's artists no. go add. More? <laughs> yeah, no, she's finished. There's nowhere else I can put anything else on this canvas. I'm gonna flip this canvas around. Now this particular one is another one where I feel like you can flip her around. Mm. 
Mm-hmm. Yes, yes. That's yes. Because I like her better. The other, it just depends. All right, Tita you, Niece. Though. I see you, Queen. Hey, Tita Niece. Y'all speak to Tita Niece. I did a black business spotlight on her some years ago. She got that dope soap. <laughs> But she do. She's a loctician, but she she's gonna be on um doing her YouTube videos soon. We were speaking yesterday. Hey, queen. Yeah. Yeah, everybody, speak to Tita Niece. She's, she's dope. <laughs> okay, so I flipped her upside down. She's kind of got a glare on her face now, but let's see. Let me see something. <clears throat> okay, so yeah, I'm gonna take that off because she get a go layer on her face. Okay, so this way, um, I enjoy drawing, uh, painting flowers. It's one of the things also that I love painting. Um, mm -hmm. I feel like the lighting on this is not the greatest, but you can still get an idea. So basically, she is um, traveling through wildflowers. Oh, I see them. Um, Have you ever used like the glow in the dark paint or the um, like this one plaid? Some matter of fact, I'm gonna send you one of these. Yeah, so I got a couple of them, like the invisible you know, glow. Right, see, like that I have it, but so I looked at it. Seem like that'll go so good. Like when that's, I don't know, I just got chills. When I seen that, I just seen them glowing for some reason. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to send you a bottle of this. Okay. I got a couple of them. I'm going to send you some more stuff with it. I ain't going to just send one bottle. <laughs> but thank you. Yeah. Yeah. She's traveling through wildflowers. Um, and, you know, like I said, I picture her as a young girl. Um, and she, if you look up at the top, I don't know if you can see, the lighting is not the, that great on this particular one, but if you look up at the top by the heart, do you see anything mm -hmm. there? Let me see. At the top by the heart, I see some, I'm looking over because I had to, um, The heart is a flower, right? The heart is a flower. It is. And then I see a rose. Right. And then I see like a daisy. Then it's like it's a blue flower too. So yeah, she what I think what I for her, my vision of her is um she's traveling through wildflowers. She's actually mm. running through wildflowers. She's taking her shoes off. And if you look up at the top where the heart is, those are the shoes that she had on. Oh. <laughs> and she's taking That's them off. That's too cute. And she's running through the wildflowers. Oh, them her feet. The, the green part, the green okay. part you're talking about? If you look, the red part. Oh. oh, the heels. You see those heels there? They're red. That's crazy. I just, when you put it closer, I seen it. Look at you. You got little, look what they call it, little um, Easter eggs in your paintings. <laughs> 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 you know how they say, you seen the Easter eggs in the movie? Right. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you naturally an artist. Even if you say you new to art, that that's in you because you you and you you always be saying I'm trying to find my lane. You were in your lane. I was like you already in your lane. Just imagine when it elevate, it's gonna be crazy. Yeah, but um, so yeah, that's what I came up with this one. And even like her the button area where the buttons are, that's really yeah. a thing holding that um. This way, it's a vase holding the, the uh, heart flower. 
that goes into the shoes that she took off as she's running through the wildflowers. If you can see yeah. that. So it's a lot of different things. You might even look and see something I something seen. Yeah, that you probably um, even know you done drew. <laughs> right. Yeah. So, you know, but um I do like to create art that you can enjoy it from different angles. Yeah, that's dope. So, that is so dope. Yeah, that's that one right there. Um and then I got one more to show you. And this one I'm working on. I'm not finished it yet, but I'm going to go ahead and show it to you anyway. Because mm -hmm. I'm at a stopping point where um, I, I'm sure the next thing I put on it or however I'm going to do it is going to come to me. But right now I'm at a stopping point. And also it's done with um, oil paint. So it's still in a dry process. So I'm not ready mm -hmm. to add on anything yet because I need to let it dry. Um, but just so you know, this particular painting right here in front that I'm showing now, this one is watercolor um, and acrylic. Though the medium and, you're using watercolor and acrylic. Right, watercolor yeah. and acrylic. And then I did finger painting uh, technique with it. So for that one. Nope. Okay, so this one right here, this is the last one that I'll show you. Oh, okay. Look at you. Um, hey, girl. You hey sitting out? <laughs> she got okay. her little dwarf earrings on. Yeah. And she is uh, inspired by... You know who she is. Oh, I see it now. <laughs> I didn't inspired. even see it at first till you just said that. Oh, that is so fly, y'all. So she inspired by the... the um. Juicy. Y'all know Juicy. Juicy, yeah. <laughs> Everybody love Juicy. Yes. I need to make some earrings. Uh, Juicy need to get her, whole, her own video. <laughs> every minute it's an order coming in for Juicy. And I don't even have, I have, have I put her on the website yet? I don't even, I think I did. I can't even remember if I put Juicy on the website. But this Juicy, y'all, this Juicy right here. Well, her name is, her nickname Juicy, but her name is Dwarfe. I mean, what it is? Divine Dwarf Goddess. Yeah. I can see it. I love the way you did that. That is so fly. Look at her. Look at her bosom. Like, she just doing it, girl. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and I love the, black, the white and red. Um, yeah, with her, um, I, I'm just adding things as I go along. And I'm going to tell y'all a story, right? Y'all might not believe me, but I think you, sh well, you should believe me because I'm telling the truth, but art is magical. Yeah. Art is magical. And let me tell you why I say that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Juicy got body. Yes, she do. <laughs> <laughs> y'all, I can't with y'all and Juicy. Juicy. Everybody like Juicy. She got to live up to her name, right? <laughs> <laughs> look, look. You, look, you created your own, but you still she's still in that essence of juicy. Look at yeah, her. she got to live <laughs> up to her name now. Come on, <laughs> I can't. <laughs> so with this, um, I used uh, watercolor, acrylic, and then it's oil painting too. So, like I said, she's going through a drying process now, so I can't really finish her up until she dries a little bit more. So she's not yeah. done. So let me say that. I love the way you put the um she's chakra queen for my earrings. Huh? Oh, you named your chakra queen. Oh. I like the way you got the, the little rectangles going around. Like that's uh, it's just something about that I like. Okay, and so then answer Africa in the back. Yes. I'm gonna tell you a and story then, about that. That's what I want to tell okay. you to share with y'all. When you paint whatever you paint on, I do it on the wood too. But I, to be honest, I actually like painting on canvas. I, I get more out of painting on canvas. But yeah. um, 
you can cross over some of the techniques, but not really all of them. Just because yeah. canvas is just a different, it's just a different foundation. Yeah. yeah. So, because I try to use some techniques from the wood and, you know, I could do it on canvas, but to me, they don't go over as well on canvas like they do it on like the wooden earrings. But did you do you do you prime yours with the geese gesso? Uh, I I did yes, I did for a couple of them. I didn't for all of them, but um, cause some of the canvas is already prime, so I didn't do it with those. Mm -hmm. But um, one one or two of them I did do the priming with the mm -hmm. um gesso mm -hmm. just to help. The yeah, color. but the gesso do it makes it more. Cause you know, um, canvas have texture, so it just make it more smoother to paint on. Right, right. And some of them, I like to have a little texture. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Um, the texture's still gonna be there. It just make it, you know, <coughs> just a little more painting. smooth. Yeah. Right. Um, the blocks around her is her aura. If you know anything okay. about that. That's yeah. Oh, okay. Yes. Yeah. I um, see aura on people. I can see them sometime on people. Yeah. That's the part of her aura. Um, the thing about this painting that I love and the process about painting that I absolutely love. And I think that's what's really got me with the painting is that I told you, I see different things when I paint and that's how I come up with the different things that I do. Um, yeah. When I was painting, this is going to sound weird, y'all, but I think you'll know for sure that I'm I'm telling the truth. But when yeah. I was painting, the part where you see the Africa and the United States, I'm going to have to go back to the United States and do a little bit of um, uh, fixing on that. But anyway, when I was painting, I painted in watercolor, right? Mm -hmm. I did the water paint. And I took and I, I wiped the canvas. When I wiped oh. the canvas, when I wiped the canvas, you see that Africa and the United States? It was on mm -hmm. my canvas. It came. It was, it came on my canvas. Mm. That's interesting. That's like some divine, magical ancestor from Africa to America type stuff going on. <laughs> it came on my canvas, no lie. The and Africa appeared by itself. Once the you Africa wipe. appeared by itself on that side, right where you see it painted. Mm -hmm. And the United States came on the other side. I showed my husband before I painted them black. I showed him where it appeared on the canvas. Mm -hmm. Because I thought, like, what is up with this? Yeah, yeah, that's some that's some spiritual art right there. So, art is magical. I said, did you see that? Do you see this? Like, I want you to see it before I paint it. Do you see this? I didn't do this other than I just wiped the canvas, <laughs> and when I wiped it, the shape of what you see on the canvas now for Africa was there. And the shape for what you see of the United States was there. Mm -hmm. And so I just went with, instead of covering it up, which some might, someone else might do, I don't You went it with up. it. I go with yeah. what I see on that canvas. And that's that didn't happen to me before in my earrings. Stuff it up has. here and I just bring it. Yeah. yeah. And I bring it to life. Yeah. Yeah. Some people might be inclined to cover it up. You know, they see it, but mm -hmm. they... Not me. They discount it and they, they cover it up. I don't do that. I, 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 whatever I see is what I paint. Yeah. Um, you know, granted, if I saw something that wasn't, I guess, pleasant or something, I wouldn't do that. But if I see something, um, but with that, I probably just make a mental note of what I see. But um, when I saw that, the Africa and the United States, I went ahead and started working on them. And that's what oh. I came with. And then once I seen the Africa in the United States, I looked at on her dress, on her shoulder, and I said, okay, let's, you know, represent 
United States. You know, let's represent. Yeah, but that. I mean, a lot of times when we conscious and all that, people don't want to talk about, um, you know, like I'm not American. Yes, you are. Even if we we don't even want to use that word, you indigenous. Like you are African American. Even if you don't want to say it, we African and we American. Yes, we should yeah. be the number one more than anybody. <laughs> right. Yeah. Yeah. And yeah. I went through that. I at times I wouldn't say that, but as you know, growing and just learning and wisdom, I'm like, I'm a part. Matter of fact, a poet named Freedom Speaks. Her name is Felicia Hunt. But a poetry name is Freedom Speaks. We was talking some years ago and she said, um, I was like, I'm ready to go to Africa. And she said, sister, you could, Africa is here. Africa is you. You know, she was a little yeah. younger than me. And she said that to me and it always stayed with me. So a lot of times we, we, we want to go somewhere and that energy of it is within us. Yeah. Africa. Yeah. You don't have to go to Africa to be Africa. You understand what I'm saying? Right. Be dope when you do physically go, but yeah, so that's dope. I like that. Um so yeah, and like I said, I'm not done working on her. I don't know what's gonna come up next to put on here. It's probably not gonna be that much more, but um this is what I'm currently working on and I just was just how, you know, it came together with the United States and the Africa and putting them together on a piece of canvas was like it really was it a long behind. Yeah. But that's what I was told to do. So, you know, in wanting to be obedient, that's what I decided to do. Oh so. yeah. I was just telling um I was talking to T Denise last night and she brought up when she looked at one of my old videos and how I was telling her how I started the earrings. I heard that voice it was a guy voice and they say, do them in your style. And I was obedient. And yeah. Yeah. So when you say be obedient, be obedient. Yeah. When you hear the, God is within us. We are God. So it's just the God in us. That's what Mary <laughs> said. Mary, Mary said, she said, God in me. <laughs> Yes. I was surprised when she said that. I always thought that way, but when she said it, because you know, a lot of people don't like that song because they want us to separate God from ourselves. And I was like, that's so dope. Yeah, I think so too. I mm -hmm. think so too. Yes. So, but yeah, these are all the paintings that I've worked on this month. And um you did good. I'm gonna continue to work on paintings. I don't know what in the world where I'm going to be putting all this stuff. <laughs> You're going to be like my need... place stuff everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to need a five bedroom house. You know? oh <laughs> I don't know where all Once we stuff start making going. stuff, it's going to get crazy. You're going to be like, he gonna be like, well, you know that cardboard. Oh, I'm just keeping it right here for a minute. <laughs> and <it> was... <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. Yeah. Yeah, I do plan to um, see if I can set up locally, though. Um, maybe yes. start an art gallery or something. Maybe they'll let me put oh, something yeah. um, in a couple of places. I am looking into that to try yeah. to, um, you know, get a little bit more exposure. And get then, aggressive when it comes yeah. to that. Be, be like, hey, can I put this up in here? <laughs> <laughs> like, you got to get out there and make it happen. Like, I, I am going to do the video, y'all, about vending and stuff like that. I know a couple of people ask me when I'm going to do the video. So the, the ones that ask me that I will do the video on just different ways that you can sell your art, not just on social media, but on social media, but other ways you can make money in your local way. Cause I did that for years. Like, um, so I'm a, like I say, April, we're going, I'm doing a video, a video will be uploaded from April the 1st to April. What is what? 30 days, 31st. I can't remember. Um, no, it's thirty days. So, I don't have a um, in front of me. Yeah, so we going So you got anything else to say, Tanika? Um, just follow me on YouTube. I'm gonna start doing um some live painting. I'm gonna start doing some informational type, uh, maybe tutorial type stuff. Yeah. Um, yeah. I just follow I my journey because I am on a journey and I, I want to share it with people because 
like I said, at one time, I, I would never do any of this stuff. Yeah. Didn't even know I could paint. Yeah. Um, And I just, you know, kept hearing that thing that was telling me to paint. And I finally did it. And I feel like it's, it's opening up something mm -hmm. about something and um there's no way i'm gonna stop now yeah hey duchess kiki hey girl <laughs> but yeah um oh yeah let me show y'all this remember we did the last diy and i never i haven't glossed it yet but i think it was it was like february mm -hmm. like the end of february we did these so i put mine together i gotta gloss it and this is how my back came out y'all Oh, I love those. Yeah. So this is how I did mine. But the DIY, it was a, li a live DIY thing. Yeah, it was a live DIY. So, yeah, and, I, and I said I was going to do this. So I finally did, in between me doing earrings, I um I, I finished these. So only thing I got to do with these is gloss them. There's something else I got to show. Oh, this is the DIY that's just got up on the channel earlier today. I've been had it, y'all. So I finally up. Well, I'm starting to get these videos out. So this is the one that I showed y'all how to make. And then this is my the the one that I had did pop a couple of years ago. And I finally finished this because <laughs> this is Kuchi Jagalia. Um so this means self-determination. So y'all go check that DIY out. And I made these flat backs. They sterling silver flat backs. Yep, so y'all check that DIY out. I think that's all I had to show y'all. I got so much um new stuff that I um will show y'all. I got some ownership designs. Uh I need to send to y'all that want them. I got all kind of stuff. But yeah. So that's let me show y'all some of these stencils. But I'm working on she's gonna be cute. I'm gonna use some of these glitters. I was just telling Tanika earlier before we got on live that Plaid got these new pastel glitters so I had to do something for her so I'm just going to use her as my what's her name so these glitters I don't know if y'all can see them so I'm going to incorporate some of these in into her that's why I'm making her different colors so they just they sent me they sent me some more stuff I'm always getting new products so yeah, so that's this is Ellie and Superstar. What I call her? No, what I call her? Ellie and Goddess. I got some earrings, some Ellie and Superstar earrings. Mm -hmm. So then we got Bob. I done mixed all kind of stuff. So let me go by real fast, y'all, with some of these stencils. So we got Ellie and Goddess, which she's 20 if anybody want her. Ellie and Goddess. Y'all, I, when I when I traced her, I forgot to do her hair, so I did her hair in my own. <laughs> she, I was doing something. I thought I had went over, so she gonna be real cute when I it's finish. Pretty. Yeah, she looked she looked strong. I just yeah. want people to know that she's a black woman. The aliens are black. <laughs> Make sure we put those features in. So this is Lock em Empress. No, this. Empress Blue Lips. I be getting these two mixed up sometimes. So this Empress Blue Lips, which is a DIY on YouTube. I released her so y'all can go check out. If y'all want to hand draw her, she's on YouTube. But if you say that's too much, people say unit is too much. I want the stencil. Here she go. And then this is Imp Lock Goddess. I need to paint her again. I haven't painted her. And here go my girl Juicy. Juicy drive us crazy. Mm -hmm. Juicy. Oh, Juicy is 20. All these I'm showing y'all is 20. So if y'all want some, these two go together. And um, you can get both of these for 25. Yeah, this is one. This is my first stencil. And when I first started doing this, when I first did this stencil, she was, I literally hand draw each, each stencil. So all the ones that got them original hand drawn stencils, like I drew them with pens. That's when I first bought her out. I don't know if y'all remember her. I think it's African. She's she's on um Designs dot com. But so but if you go go there, it's gonna be a little more. But if you want them, 
looking at this video, she's 25. And I think I got her for 20. This is Comedic Goddess. I haven't even touched her yet. I just see gold all over her. Just gold. Her face gold. Mm -hmm. Everything gold. Gold, gold, gold. She would be pretty <laughs> on canvas. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. That's Comedic Goddess. So she's 20. Um, This is, y'all know who this is. They making me real mad. <laughs> So this is her. And when you buy this stencil, the um some of the money goes towards her GoFundMe. Yeah. And then this is Earth Goddess. I got to finish my Earth Goddess. I ain't finished her yet. She's so cute. She's 20. And this is a stencil that's with the set. So I don't know if I'm selling her separate. But if y'all want her separate, y'all could get her for 15. But it's a goddess set that I have on the um knordesigns.com. And I think it's like seven stencils for like 65, something like that. Yeah. And then this is my girl, Protection Goddess. This is how I drew her. I think I drew her live with y'all. Yeah, I did. I drew her live with y'all. So this is my version. I'm making this a necklace for me. And I'm going to put some, some amethyst and some stones around. I'm going to keep this raw. I just, for some reason, I just want to keep that raw. Yeah. So that's how I did my protection goddess. You see what I got? This is um her, but I'm, I, the, her afro, I don't know why I never closed her afro in. But her afro will be closed in if you order her. And I know, I, I remember somebody was like, they got, they was going, when they got theirs, they was going to draw words in her, in her earrings. And I didn't even think about that. It's so cool. It's and then somebody was like, she looked like, she got lips like Tatiana. <laughs> People so funny. And then here go Aunt Goddess. I haven't finished her yet either. That's Aunt Goddess. Then we got the waist beads. Yeah. This ain't one then we got her and that's some more we got the chair the chair gonna always this in black history now y'all it's the anniversary gonna come up soon but august of, <laughs> so the chair is always ten dollars if y'all want the chair so I, and then we got you know it's so many stencils y'all so if y'all just see conscious daughter it's so many of them omec the omex and I have a DIY. It's a paid DIY to show y'all how to just draw him, hand draw him, if y'all want to learn how to hand draw him. It's so many of them. I'm going to do a whole video because there's so many that I haven't had time even to put on um, the website. It's so many of them. So I'm going to just, one of those videos that's coming up going to show, um, oh, there I go, your girl. That go your girl right there, y'all. Oh, Crown sure. goddess. Yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't they say there she go? Then we got Bob right here. Here you go. A couple more. We got Bob. And that go juicy. And then that's the butterfly goddess lady. And her, I got to paint her. She's going to be one of my next ones to paint. So, yeah, so it's a whole bunch of stencils. If y'all see anything, just screenshot it and then hit me up on KUnity77 on Instagram. DM me if y'all see anyone y'all want. Or you just go over to the knordesigns.com. So those, the stencils, this is the newest one. I'm going to mess with her eye a little bit more. But So that's mainly it, y'all. Um, Candace is going live. Hey, Candace. Hey, girl. What's her last... What is her name again? The last one. Which one, Queen? You talk about um this one right here? A juicy. To my this one. You might gotta look at the pay playback because I know I was moving fast. Um crafty lock petition. You talking about this one? You got a couple of I got some of her printed up. Where do these come from? You have to just screenshot it on the what's her name. Brianna Taylor. 
You talking about Brianna Taylor? Or the one before Brianna, maybe. Child, I done put them up. Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> the one before Brianna. Let's go. I think that was the one she asked about. I like when I draw um, a lot of them. I feel comedic, like, goddess. comedic goddess. Yeah, it's the one I said yeah. would look good on um, canvas. Yeah, I'm gonna do her. I'm a I'm a glitter gold her up. Yeah, she's twenty. Yeah, like I haven't even touched her yet, but I can't wait because I'm gonna. She gonna be dope. I think I'm gonna just use all different kind of golds and glitters, and it's just like, yeah. So, yeah, she's twenty. I can't wait to mess with her. So I'm gonna be working on her tonight. Besides orders, be finishing her up, and I'm gonna add these these glitters that they send me to her. But uh, Lynette, y'all, like I said, Candice. Yeah, you spelled it right. You spelled it right on time. Well, I spelled goddess a little different, but yeah, it's goddess. Um, so Candice is going live on the 28th, and then I'll be put doing a DIY the last day of the month. So y'all get another DIY and I will be uploading a DIY either the night or tomorrow night. Cause I got my day is going to be crazy busy tomorrow. And, um, like I say, a video will be uploaded to my YouTube channel every day of April. So y'all look out there. It can be, yeah, Candace 29th. So Every day of April, I'm uploading a video. It could be a Unity Spotlight. It could be a DIY. It could be me just sitting and talking because I want to introduce Goddess Talk to y'all. Um, I'm going to have a guest on and we're going to, I'm going to introduce it on this channel, but I'm going to take it over to my other channel, which called Boava 2. We'll talk more about that. So that's mainly it, y'all. Um, I got some ownership designs on the scene, y'all. The ones that, um, it's interesting in the ownership designs. If y'all never bought an ownership design from me, an ownership design is a design that, matter of fact, I could show y'all one. I just got to hook it. It's mainly ready to go. I just, I got a dope bead, hand painted bead. So this is an ownership design. So if anybody wanted, y'all better hit her up. Oh, she not good. glossed yet, but um, she could be y'all's. Y'all can reproduce it. And if y'all need, any help with getting the shape, just let me know. I'll give y'all all that information. So but I got some, this just one. So I'm going to show y'all these. I start sending them tomorrow or tonight. And um, the one, people that's interested in ownership design, well, ownership designs, like if you buy this design, it is yours. I don't, I will never make it. Uh, I, will, I will make it, but it would just be for me and advertisement, but I will never sell it. So it'd be yours. You can mass produce it, duplicate it, do what you want to do with it. It will be yours. So that's what the ownership designs is. So if anybody that has never bought an ownership design for me, hit me up on Instagram, KUND77, and I will show you the ones that's available for ownership. But other than that, y'all, I'll see y'all in um I'll see y'all. We'll see y'all the 29th. And then y'all just check the channel out. And if y'all want to join the membership, the links, the links will be in the description box. And if y'all want to connect with Tanika, all her information will be in the description box. And um, her YouTube channel is Soul Creation. All that, I put the links because I got to go subscribe to it too. So everybody go support her to get her up to 500 subscribers so she can um, start getting paid for YouTube. <laughs> but before then, when she started, y'all, if y'all could donate a dollar to her, or more that'll help her be motivated to keep her channel going and all that and also candace have a youtube channel um i think crafty loctician has a youtube channel so yeah all y'all gotta come on and live and y'all gotta promote so y'all always got a safe space over here it's a safe space it's not a space that we don't do drama we'll tell somebody off because to look <laughs> real quick with the block finger <laughs> and candace is too <laughs> And I love that we respect everybody. Um, um, we learn from each other. And even though I've been doing this for a long time, I still learn from y'all. I want to let y'all know that. Uh, Candace's channel is Candace Carlisle. That is her YouTube channel. Okay. 
All right, family. I'm gonna let y'all go. I know I probably got crazy messages because I got my I, I did put my phone on um do not disturb. <laughs> so nobody went interrupt. All right, you got anything else to say, Tanika? No, good night, everybody. Thank y'all for joining. Um, I appreciate y'all coming on and supporting me in my journey. Um, I, I'm going to continue to do new things. I hope you continue to do new things as well. Um, I love I love this segment. Yeah. I love you got your passport. I love. I can't wait. You yes. go to South Africa and you can. Ooh. You got to vlog. You yes. got to vlog. I can't wait. Yeah. You gotta vlog. Oh. You gotta you gotta um, wear your um my side earrings when you go too. <laughs> yes, I am. I started to wear them tonight, but then I, I, I changed up. But yeah. yeah, well, them dope, them dope. What you got? Yeah. On. Wait, okay. I do, but I have, I do, but I have not started anything on it yet. Hopefully this week. Yes, just like when you look at. I don't know if you came in when Tanika was talking. Just do it. Forget the fear. Yeah, you you was in. Yeah fear if you want to do something just do it you know how many people come to me instagram email i want to start a youtube channel and i'd be like just start it but i gotta get a camera yeah. use your phone <laughs> yeah. maybe it's like a, it's always an excuse to do yeah. something just do it it's a combination it. of fear perfection that was my thing i always make up an excuse but i'm no i'm not gonna do that anymore i just gotta do it yeah, the rest I just realized Miss Tr. It's a couple people went on tonight, but Miss Tr. I know she wasn't feeling well. I'm gonna hear her up and make sure she okay because uh -oh. she usually be one on here, you know. Yeah, and she's a sweetie. Yeah, I didn't see her yeah. on here, and yeah, I don't really go through and, and you know welcome everybody, but I just want everybody to know that um sometimes I see the messages and sometimes I don't right away just because I'll be talking so much. But um I really do appreciate when y'all come on and um you know and support because it's really yes. important and it you know it means a lot. Yeah. So I appreciate All it. All right family okay y'all don't don't forget to pick up litter in your community. Respect those that respect you. Leave a beautiful comment. Thumbs up this video and um Adopt a pet from your local rescue or shelter. And I will see y'all in the next video. Salam, salam.